what's up guys MAS here I want to do a quick video on this uh, plugin that I've been using with FL studio uh, for a little while now it's called auto theory uh, what it does is it helps you to play chords and and notes in the same key in the correct key automatically so if you're not familiar with music theory like me um, it kind of uh, helps you with that so I'm just gonna kind of get right into it um, if anybody has it and they're having trouble installing it and stuff like that, um, I could do another video on that. Um, you can just leave uh, some comments down in the comment section and uh, I might be able to help you out with that. But um, alright, so first I'm going to open it up and kind of show you the interface real quick. It's very important too that once you get it installed, and this is with FL Studio, I don't use any other uh, DAWs. But um, to open Auto Theory first, make sure your MIDI keyboard, if you have one, is plugged in already. Then open this, and then FL Studio. If you do it, if you don't do it in that order, for some reason it doesn't really work correctly. Um, all right, so this is the interface here. Um, as you can see, um, these are the chord keys over here. Um, you would hit the left side of your uh, your keyboard. You can see it lighting up. It's not making any sound because I don't have FL Studio open yet, but it plays the keys. The chords, excuse me, in the correct key, uh, whichever one you predetermine up here. All the keys are here, um, major, minor, all that stuff. Um, lots of options: triads, sevenths, fifths, uh, chord tones, dynamic scales, relative scales, pregiator, which I like to use a lot. Um, I'll explain a little bit on how that works. This is the tempo. Uh, you want to match it up to whatever tempo you're working with in your DAW. Um, and this is bypass, which you use. If you have a MIDI keyboard, um, you have your pads on there, you know, to, to lay down drums and stuff like that. You need to activate bypass in order for that to work. Um, another thing, uh, for some reason, whenever I open it, um, this is not checked, but channel one has to be selected on both sides. These are the single notes over here. So uh, let's open up FL Studio and I'll kind of show you guys what it does and how it kind of makes the uh, workflow a little bit faster. All right, so let's just throw uh, any kind of instrument in there, really. Uh, let's see what we got. We can go with Citrus. Uh, let's work with some kind of piano or something like that. I like Rhodes, so let's see if we can get Rhodes. There we go. So um, I can't have them up on the screen at the same time, unfortunately. But um, so when you hit your your left side keys, see I'm just hitting keys in succession, and they're already in the proper key. And then your single notes are over here. And the single notes will match up to whatever, um, I don't know how to say it, because I'm, like I said, I'm not into music theory, but I guess um, maybe like the same scale. So like if I hit like a lower chord, the notes, single notes match up to it. You also have your octaves here. Um, so you can bring your single notes down. Um, you can bring your chords down too a little bit. So this this uh this plugin right here is amazing. Um I got it off of I can't remember what website, I think it was plugin boutique or something like that. And um it, it was about 30 35 bucks it really really has changed things for me as far as music production um, I, I definitely recommend it um, there are some tutorials um, they're a little old but um, some of them are updated but not really anything catered to FL studio um, I'm probably forgetting some stuff but I didn't want to make this video too long so um, if you have any questions about it um, and how it works along with a MIDI keyboard. Also, real quick, it does work with your laptop PC or keyboard. So you can just use your laptop keyboard and it does the same thing. That's why I think it's really a huge asset to especially beginning uh, producers, um, any genre of music. I think it will help you 
in any kind of way really um and uh that's pretty much it uh if you like this video drop a like a comment make sure you subscribe to the channel that's it peace